Celosas workflow modules allows the user to define a series of steps that can be orchestrated based on a set of parameters. Workflow module contains a workflow designer and workflow engine. Let's look at some of the key features supported in workflow module. These are the set of features we will be looking at in the following demonstration. So let's get started with the demo. Workflow designer with drag and drop user interface. Cella workflow is a web 2.0 based workflow process management tool which facilitates both developer and end user to create customizable and extendable workflows. Develop, extend and customize using the Cello workflow SDK. Developers can create activities or tasks based on the application or domain by following a standard and procedure of Cello framework, which is basically simply writing your class definitions by implementing interfaces and inheriting certain base classes. And finally, register these activities with Cello framework in order to get these activities listed in the user interface. Supports single and batch workflow. Cello workflow supports execution of batch workflows and single workflows. Cello leverages asynchronous message processing and multi-threading concepts to fast forward the execution process in an asynchronous manner. So it's ideal for processing bulk data at the same time. Supports manual and auto activities. Cello workflow supports both manual and automatic tasks. Example for a manual task could be approving a blog post by the administrator manually or reviewing a loan request. Automatic task could be sending email, processing some data automatically, etc. Designate tasks for different actors in the application. When it comes to manual activities, it is some manual intervention that is going to perform the action and not the system itself. So it is important to assign users to a request. Seller workflow helps you design it actors to a particular task either dynamically or statically. This can be done using the interface provided by the administrator and they can decide to designate users who may belong to a particular role or group for a particular request. Advanced Workflow Dashboard End users or the application providers can have a unified view of what the current status of actions performed by the application users or to identify where exactly the flow is and to understand who owns the request in a given point in time. Support for business rules. A workflow constitutes of different tasks or activities put together in a logical manner in order to achieve an output. But there could be different conditions that need to be evaluated before triggering an activity. Sometimes based on the output of the predecessor, the successor has to start, execute, skip or end. Therefore, seller workflow supports conditions such as code, task and business rules which can be leveraged to achieve this functionality. Predefined activities. Cello workflow engine is a neutral platform to build any kind of distributed scalable applications. So when it comes to workflow, there are activities which are common for any domain, business and applications, such as sending notifications, approval or calling web services. Cello workflow provides these activities by default, which could be used by the developers and the end users straight out of the box. Execution based on schedule and event. Cello workflow can be integrated with the other components of the Cello framework such as time based schedulers and event systems. For example, you could use schedulers to send a report based on some time or execute a workflow based on some action that occurs in the application. Workflow persistence. Workflow persistence is the capture of a workflow instance state independent of its process. This is done to provide a well known point of recovery for the workflow instance in the event of system failure or to preserve memory by unloading workflow instances that are not actively doing work or to move the state of the workflow instance from one node to another node in a server form. Persistence enables process agility, scalability and recovery in the face of failure. It also provides the ability to manage memory more efficiently. Cello uses SQL Server to persist the workflow metadata 
and the table structure of default metadata which comes along with the framework. Cascading configuration from parent tenant to subtenant. Seller workflow supports tenant hierarchy. In the context of workflow, the parent tenants or root level tenants can create workflows and cascade the same settings and workflows to their subtenant as like their child tenants. Workflow also supports auditing and logging. The purpose of workflow auditing is to record who did what to which activities and when did they do it. Audit events are handled by seller workflow runtime by simply enabling configurations. Similarly, logging enables us to catch any exceptions that are global. Multiple version support. Seller workflow provides simple and effective way of maintaining multiple versions of a given workflow. The application provider or customers can create their own workflows or global workflows for all their subtenants. Once they make their workflow as global, the same instance will be available for all the tenants underneath them. Then these subtenants can then copy or modify it as per their requirement. Support for code based and stored procedure based activities. There are two major categories of activities supported by Cello workflow. They are code based activity and stored procedure activity. Code based, based activities are logic written in C sharp and compiled as a binary whereas stored procedure activities are logics which runs in the SQL server and returns back the output to the activity. You can also invoke a web service by creating a code workflow activity and call the web service. 